Hey, my name is Zach, and I wanted to show you how to separate an image into layers. Sometimes you find an image and you like it, but you don't like the way that it's edited. You want the person to pop a little bit out of the background or something like that. And that's exactly what I'm going to show you how to do now. You're going to be able to modify the image and take one image and turn it into a bunch of different layers. So first we're going to go to File and then Open. We're going to scroll down on my desktop to this superhero image I have and hit Open. Now, I'm going to separate him from the background so we have separate layers. I also want all these orange tabs to be separate from these translucent orange tabs. So first, I'm going to go to the Quick Selection tool, and that's right here. You can use your bracket keys to change the size. So first, I'm going to go around and select all the orange. You just have to click, and you can see it's selected a lot more there. We'll hit Alt and hit Minus and it'll minus up the stuff we don't want. And we can carefully click here to try and re-sculpt. And we'll continue on. If this isn't working exactly how you expected it to, what we could also do is go to the Magic Wand tool. And we'll select here. And that selects a more true depiction. But what you have to do is hit and hold Shift to add all these together. That looks better. So what we're going to do is hit Control X, and then we're going to hit Control V. So once we select the Magic Wand tool, we can select all this other orange. <coughs> Make sure you hit Shift to add all of it. Now we can hit Control X and then Control V. We'll move it back to where it was by selecting the Move tool. And put it right back where it was. Now we can change the name of this to Light Orange. And the top one, we can change it to Dark Orange. Now we can put this layer back on, and we're going to use the effects now. So this layer here, we're going to hide these again. And we want to get rid of all this black here. So we'll use the magic wand tool, and then just hit delete. This is unneeded information that was in the image. And as you can see, we have a perfect render cutout of the superhero. And that's his own layer. So we'll call this one Superhero. Now we can hit Control D to deselect. And we can turn these layers back on. Now the superhero moved a little bit, so we'll just have to make sure the move tool is selected and we can move him back into his original location. We'll go to effects here and we can go blending options. So we can go to drop shadow and we can change the distance and the angle. We can also do an inner glow, an outer glow, I like the inner glow. I think that adds a really cool element. And we could even change the opacity of these to, let's say, 60%. This one as well. 
and gives it a really cool different look. My name's Zach and I just showed you how to separate an image into different layers. This is a cool way to edit and I hope it helped. Thank <laughs> you.